Hallöchen, Hallöchen, Hallöchen. Herzlich willkommen zurück zu Life is Strange. Apparently Blackwell has a severe toilet paper fetish. Und wir müssen irgendwie in die VIP-Section, aber ich habe keine Ahnung wie. God, are you mental? You can't come in. Vielleicht irgendwie von der anderen Seite? Es tut mir so leid, dass wir Alyssa nicht haben retten können. Das ist voll scheiße. Wir haben die bisher immer, immer gewarnt. Aber die, eben habe ich das nicht, nicht gecheckt, dass das ja Alyssa war, die da ins Wasser geworfen wurde und habe einfach nicht zurückgespult. Das tut mir voll leid für die, ey. Aber echt, mal. Hm. I could push this out of the way and officially crash the VIP section. <lacht> Oh. Oh oh. Okay, okay, whoa, whoa, who stopped the music, okay? DJ, what the fuck? Whoopsie Daisy. Oh my god, DJ Duo was checking me out. Me guy. Yes, you. Wait. Okay, ich muss scheinbar zurückspulen. Ich muss das irgendwie anders aus dem Weg räumen, scheint mir. Das war nicht so cool, dass wir da... Ach so, ach, ich bin ja jetzt dahinter. Ah, stimmt. Sehr gut. So. Dann werden wir mal die VIP-Club betreten hier. Hallöchen. Jetzt war jetzt aber, habt ihr euch aber bequem gemacht, da? Was schreibt Kate? Thank you so much for coming by me. You lifted my heart. Kate, I was happy to see you smile again. You mean so much to me and so many others. That's one of the things in the school books I needed. Give him a hug. Fuck your selfie. Da können wir uns hinsetzen. Will ich gerade nicht. Was der DJ? Zachary, Juliet. Können wir die stören? Ne, wir können die nur angucken. Trevor, Dana. Ja. Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, me, Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. You still pissed about me taking your picture? Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you and me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. I don't blame you, Victoria, but you know Kate had a church group and that she didn't party. So why did you send out that video? Oh, God. I swear we weren't even going to do it. Then we had some wine and got stupid. It's more than stupid. It's mean. Hateful. Kate never did anything to you. And that didn't stop you from taking one last video of her on the roof. I deleted that from my phone. Maybe I'm not her friend, but I didn't get off on Kate attempting suicide. I'm not evil, Max. I believe you, Victoria. But I don't understand you. That makes both of us, Max. I always feel like I have to overcompensate. For what, I have no clue. I'm only here to become a photographer, not president. We sind mal nett, komm. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. Yeah, Mr. Jefferson probably won't be choosing my photo. I'm not as talented as I thought. Yes, you are. But we shouldn't have to choose between talent and kindness. I hope. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's gonna happen. But not for the reasons you think. 
Oh, you look so serious. Nein, wir, wir warnen sie, wir warnen sie. Wir warnen sie. Victoria, enough of this high school bullshit. We're adults now. So listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know you're close to Nathan, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace. Dark. Oh my god. And I'm the drama queen? Touche. But I am not fucking around here. Sorry, but no. No way. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not. You have to believe me. I don't believe anything you say. You're full of shit. Oh, hi, I'm Max Caulfield, and I'm so sensitive that butterflies make me cry. Now, will you listen? No, I won't. You're just pissed because you didn't enter a photo in the contest and that Mr. Jefferson is going to pick me. A real artist would have busted ass to win, but you just want to take your little retro selfies. That is so fucking lame and lazy, Max. Just go find a community college. Victoria, please don't do this. Especially after what happened with Kate. Can't you see I'm serious? That's your problem, Max. This is a party, and it's the end of the world, so I am going to get so wasted, even you won't bother me anymore. I'll let Nathan know if he finally shows up. Adios. Au revoir. Weißt du, dann halt nicht. Dann halt nicht, dann stirb halt. Dumme Schlampe, ey. Da wollten wir mal nett sein, weißt du? Und so was. Okay, I tried. She's not gonna believe me over her Vortex Club partner. Me. Me. That son of a bitch is not here. Where are you, Nathan? I better get Chloe. So it's us. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the locker. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it! Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson! <laughs> Are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Mm. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Yeah. Wo ist Nathan? Okay, okay. everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, look, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Now, this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Come on! Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Oh, klar. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. <laughs> She is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back. Thank you. You suck, Victoria. 
Victoria. <laughs> Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Oh. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Okay, checken wir die aus. Oh Christ, Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Diese zwei Monde? Oh. Der verschwindet gerade? Wett? Was geht ab hier? Was geht ab, Alter? Jetzt haben wir nur noch einen Mond. Der ein bisschen verzerrt scheint. Achso, eine Pfütze. Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Whoa. So creepy out here. Uh-huh. Max, when we catch Nathan, you better rewind so I can kill him over and over. Oh, for God's sake, Chloe, you have to be quiet. We could die, Max, okay? Please hurry. Oh God, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Oh! Oh, was, 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 was? Nein, 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 nein. Chloe! Look out. What the fuck? What? In den Kopf geschossen. Fuck. Oh nein, oh nein, oh nein, oh nein, oh nein. Chloe. Fuck. Chloe. What? What? Mr. Jefferson? Mr. fucking Jefferson? Hat Chloe erschossen? Bitte was? Ich verstehe gar nichts mehr. Ich verstehe gar nichts mehr. Wieso war das denn Mr. Jefferson jetzt? Alter. Ah, jetzt wieder Monate auf den nächsten Teil warten. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Mr. Jefferson hat Chloe erschossen und uns unter Drogen gesetzt. Mr. Jefferson ist das. Und Nathan war ihm wahrscheinlich auf der Spur. Nathan war Mr. Jefferson irgendwie auf der Spur. Vielleicht arbeitet Mr. Jefferson mit Nathans Vater zusammen und hat deshalb diesen diesen Atomschutzbunker da benutzt. Und Nathan war vorher da, weil er den auch gerade erst gefunden hat. Deshalb waren auch seine Reifenspuren da. Kann das sein? Mr. Jefferson ist so ein Pedo? Schreibt mir bitte eure Theorien in die Kommentare. Alter, wie krass. <lacht> da hat ja wohl niemand mit gerechnet, dass Mr. Jefferson... <lacht> fuck you, ey, fuck you. Scheiße, Mann. Mr. Jefferson hat Chloe erschossen. Wir können nicht zurückspulen, weil wir vorher unter Drogen gesetzt wurden. 
ob Nathan dann im Endeffekt einer von den Guten ist. Kann ich das überspringen? Ja. Okay, schauen wir uns mal die äh, Vergleiche mit den anderen an. Oh, die meisten haben Chloe umgebracht, so wie wir. Und die wenigsten haben äh, Nathan verprügeln lassen. Oh, guck mal, da haben aber echt viele, hier, da haben echt viele so lange gespielt, dass niemand äh, verletzt wurde wahrscheinlich. Und bis 76 haben die Warnung geglaubt. Wie haben die das denn geschafft? Wie haben die das denn geschafft, dass Victoria den geglaubt hat? Hey, wir haben den Blue Jay gerettet. Wir haben das nicht gestört, das Nest. Ach so, guck mal, 13 haben den Code gefunden. Man hätte auch den Code finden können, okay. Kate helped you find Nathan's room. Okay, 63 Prozent. Wahrscheinlich die anderen da ist äh, Kate tot, wahrscheinlich. You didn't motivate Danny to attend the Vortex Club Party. Nee. Okay, wir haben keine Nachricht auf Nathans äh, Brett dahinter lassen. Und <lacht> wir haben Nathans Pincode nicht rausgefunden wie die meisten. Yay. Und... Oh, wir sind gehören zu den Wegen, die Elissa nicht geholfen haben, nur weil ich es nicht gecheckt habe, dass sie das war. Ich dachte, das wäre irgendein Typ da aus dem Vortex Club, der da einfach mit dieser Poolnudel. Ah, scheiße. Okay, verdammt. Okay, da gucken wir uns noch den Trailer für die nächste Episode an. Strange, Episode 5, Polarized. Steht da schon, wann das rauskommt? Coming soon. Schade, okay. Boah. Alter Vater. Ich glaube, es gab einige unter euch, die Mr. Jefferson ziemlich heiß fanden. <lacht> Na, tut ihr das immer noch? <lacht> Mr. Jefferson ist der Böse. Mr. Jefferson ist der Böse. Alter Vater. Okay, das war Life is Strange Episode 4. Ich danke euch sehr fürs Zusehen. Es tut mir leid, dass ich zwischendurch mal so äh, geraged habe, aber das war echt blöd. Aber jetzt am Ende hasse ich das Spiel noch mehr, weil es so einen ekelhaften Spoiler hinterlassen hat, der, wer weiß, wie lange das jetzt noch hält. Äh, wie lange es jetzt noch dauert, bis das äh, Season-Finale rauskommt. Naja, ich danke euch sehr fürs Zusehen. Ich hoffe, ihr hattet so viel Spaß am Spiel wie ich. Ob, trotz meines Rages hatte ich viel Spaß, glaubt's mir oder nicht. Ähm, sag ich bis zum nächsten Let's Play oder bis Life is Strange Episode 5 Polarized, die hoffentlich nicht zu lange auf sich warten lässt. Bis dahin, macht's gut. Tschüsschen!